hello world welcome back to my channel in this video tutorial sessions we're going to see how you can create professional documents using an editor which is different from word which is known as latex so latex is an a an, an editor that can help you to create professional documents m better than word actually and mostly it's used in um, academia when doing thesis dissertations and also when writing articles and project reports and project proposals so latex runs on softwares and the, the main softwares we have uh, text studio and text maker which both need a console known as make text in order to run but uh latex can also be run online using an editor known as overleaf so that's what we're going to use to see how we can create documents in latex so overleaf is online if i type on overleaf so this is it the website i click on it so these are the various projects i've already worked on and uh, uh, i want to create a new project blank project and i'm going to call it um i'm going to call it a uh, tutorial okay so this is a new project i want to write a professional document using latex so i'm using overleaf online because it's very free you don't need to download so this is how it appears at the beginning so we have the title we have the author we have the date we have and section so this is how it is now if you want to download this document you click on this place and you have this one showing how the document is and we also have the page number but now this is just one page of a document and as you can realize it's not very good because uh, there's no chapter the spacing is too much and many other sorts so we want to write we want to make this document more professional so in the next videos we're going to see how we can step by step create a full report using latex overleaf online editor so already i'm going to delete this and i want to write a report so i'm not going to use the article uh, utility i'm going to use report and i want my font size i want my font size to be i want my font size to be 12 so i'm going to put here 12 points 12 points all right then i'm going to remove this and uh, i want to add a chapter to my document i want to add a chapter to my document so we have here a chapter and i'm going to call it uh, learning let us say we are in physics um let me just call it um what can i call it um, okay new Tons laws of motion. Okay. So this document is more professional. All right. So here, at this level of introduction, I can write something. I'll say in this chapter we're going to see. We're going to understand the three laws of motion established by sir isaac newton okay so the document step by step begin be becomes more uh, becomes more professional all right so this is how it is so we can also add other sections you can add another section uh you can call it newton's newton's first law of motion all right newton's first law of motion i can add another section again and i call it uh, Call it Newton's second law of motion, and I add another section again. And I call it Newton's third law of motion. Okay. 
so step by step our document becomes more professional so you can simply increase these sections here to get uh, more sections for your document okay so we can write more stuff in, inside here so that is how it is so um, in the next tutorial what we need to see is like uh, how we can reduce this spacing and also how we can um, introduce images into our document so thank you for watching and see you at the next tutorial thank you